Hi there, this is Sadaf. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to give you 5 tips or suggestions that might help you improve the performance of your computer or a laptop. So let's jump into it. The first step is to check for the Windows update. For that, you go to Windows menu, settings, and click updates and security. Here you will check for the updates. One of the best ways to get the most out of your PC or a laptop is to always make sure that you have the latest version of Windows 10 installed. And also it's a good idea to check for the updates uh, frequently because Microsoft continuously releases updates for Windows 10, which are designed to fix common bugs that reduce systems performance. Some of these updates are fairly minor while Others make significant changes to your computer, maximizing its efficiency. Once the windows are updated, sometimes it's going to ask you to restart your computer. Um, you restart your computer and then turn it back on. The second tip that I have for you is to restart your computer anytime you see the slowness in your computer. This is a simple step, but when you have a lot of apps, programs, or software is open in your computer, that could slow down your computer quite a bit. Even having a lot of tabs open in your browser can slow down your computer. And if this is happening, then close down all the extra tabs that you're not using. Even close down any apps that you are not using at the moment. Then restart your computer and it should definitely improve the performance of your computer. It is also a great idea to turn off your laptop after working on it for a couple of hours and give it some rest and then work on it again. Tip number three. One of the best ways to make your computer run faster is to free up some disk space. To do that, you go in the search bar and type disk cleanup. This dialog box will open showing the C drive by default. You will hit, hit OK. And here is the list of all the folders that you can free the space from. By default, downloaded programs, temporary files, and recycle bin are selected. You go ahead and checkbox any folder that you want to delete. I will select all of them and hit OK. And then it's going to ask me for my permission to delete the files permanently, and I'll select Yes. It may take a couple of moments, so be patient. To free up the space even more, again you type in the search bar disk cleanup. And this time you select cleanup system files. It may take a couple of moments again, wait for it. Click OK. And there you go. Tip number four is to disable any unnecessary startup programs. When you turn on your PC, some programs start automatically and run in the background. You don't realize they are running, but they, they will open quickly when you go to use them because they are already running in the background. While this is helpful for those programs that you use very often, but if there are programs that you don't use frequently, you probably want to disable them because they are slowing down your computer's performance. To do that, you go to Windows menu again, Settings, Apps, and select Startup. 
and here is the list of all those programs that start running as soon as I turn on my laptop. Now, I already have disabled so many programs, so I don't have a big list, but you may have a long list. This screen is showing up all the apps that are running in the background as soon as you turn on your laptop. I don't use many of them all the time, so it is a good idea to disable them. For example, I don't use any desk. I don't use the Creative Cloud apps. I don't use Oprah browser a lot. So you go through this list and disable all of them that you don't use a lot. One thing I do want to mention here, do make sure that you don't disable any program that says Microsoft Corporation because these programs might be helping your Windows to run. And also you don't want to disable any antivirus. Once you disable any unnecessary programs, you close the window. Tip number five, adjusting the appearance of windows. Windows 10 comes with many fancy visual effects such as animations and shadow effects. Now, although they look great, great, but they can also use additional system resources and slow down your computer. This is especially true if you have a PC with a smaller amount of RAM or memory. So to adjust the visual effects of Windows in the search bar, type performance. And from here you choose adjust the appearance and performance of Windows. This dialog box opens right now let windows choose what's best for my computer is selected i'm going to go ahead and select adjust for best performance then i'm going to hit apply then click ok and after that i will restart my computer for all those changes to take effect so guys these are few tips that are always helpful for me anytime I am facing slowness in my computer and I hope they were helpful for you too. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I hope you have a great day and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye for now.